Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new close on Dyson Sphere video. First of all, I'm going to tell you guys something. Happy Valentine's Day. And also, I want to show you something. And this if I can find it. Mm -mm. We're still continuing to do Dyson Sphere program. Because you guys are really liking it. Alright, you can see for the last three episodes. So, today, I don't know what, what, we, there. what we are doing today yet. But, um, so, feel free to ask any questions or things that you want to see in my videos. Anyways, please let us in the comments. So, today, we don't know what I'm not, I don't know what we're going to do today yet. But I really want to get some stuff in. Like, for example, I think we have everything automated that. Yep, we have all that stuff. And we have all of that stuff that we even made. So high priorities is these two things. But boom, we don't need as much stuff. So these two are the highest things we need this is something we don't need to automate as much but we should automate and um and i also want to start messing with the oil oil yes oil today this video the extractor and but I mean that happen I don't know yet because there might be too that might be too much but that would be a good one to get it I'm gonna try to make this video shorter because like the last couple of all the Dyson Sphere videos have been kind of a long this 50 minutes, 40 minutes, 44 minutes. So they've been a little too long. So better try to make this one under 40. That might not happen. That might will happen. Anyways, so first thing we're gonna do is let's try to get. With automated first. Uh, no. Like I said, we're trying to save time with this video, so I'll just cut the video until we get all the materials we were in an area to build these. So, I'm gonna go get the iron and the magnetic oil. So, I'll just cut the video until I get all that stuff. There! Oh, wait! found a problem. What is this? This is unacceptable. Okay, okay. Okay, let's fluff out the system. To get rid of all the copper out of that system. I was going to get the magnetic coils until I realized we're not making any magnetic coils. Yikes. Yikes. We need to make more magnetic coils now. Let's go have another one of those for now. are going to need it and I'm assuming that we're going to have to put some kind of sorter stuff on this so you are only going to be trained self set filter to where you can only get copper you can only get that So I'm gonna go around and delete all of these. So now. Mm. 
Yeah, feels like that. Alright, so I'll really cut the video until I'm done with this part. And then I'll do something. So let's cut the video until I'm done doing all this sorting stuff. Yeah. This one looks like a pretty good one. Alright. So what I did is I put all like the sorters on here. And I also made a little backup system so if any copper gets through all of this it's just gonna go back on the copper line with this and this is also only set to pick up the copper from this line if it backs up with copper for whatever reason which it shouldn't but if it does for whatever reason let's say it can just in case the backup system so it goes to here then go back on the center oh. now we'll use the so first now this is what I like to see. Blue. Let's delete that. Put a blue one on. I don't want it making so much. And that's it. If you go put the production right. By the exact amount of the production right. And so it's gonna have enough to keep supporting that. It's also have enough to powering all of those. So I'm happy then. There's nothing to complain about. Yeah, so let's actually cut the video and people get the iron and these things over here and I put some of the scenes, but of course, Anyway, so I'll just cut the video until I get those new materials. Oh wow, that took a little bit of a minute. And it's not as easy as it looks. It confused me a little bit. But, yes, it was silly that I said it would look. So I'm just gonna build two machines, honestly, just to make these power lines, because we really don't need Let's have a nice curve like that. Oh, wait a second. Oh. So, 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 what we gotta do here? Um, way higher than I thought it was going to be. I actually have to do is oh mm, what does it do? Why is it so confusing? Okay, I got it. So we're gonna have to just stick to do it this way. And then because these two the scenes hopefully will fit. I want to get the power lines that we're about to go automate. Right there. Place one right there. And right there. I want to select those. Let's go like that. And then I'm going to also get it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Filter, so that can only do that. This one can only. Your production compound has reached a certain scale. Now click the statistics panel yeah, button yeah. at the bottom right need corner help. of the I screen to I view statistics. It includes the output consumption of each item, electricity data, etc. Use these dynamic know. data can help you to manage your production base. I don't speak your language. I'm good speaking with. Ugh. 
Oh, we should really automate this. We're yeah, not that hard to automate. We just need some iron and a little bricks.
Let's find a clear. Alright. And now we have the symbol or something. It's done. What is next on the list? I don't know if you remember the last episode. I mean the list. It has to be done. This it's really hard. So I don't want to do it, but I have to. Okay guys, quick announcement, um, I will not be cutting the video from this point in the video, so I might say that I'll cut the video to a different point, but that's just a lie, this is just wanted to tell you, but yeah, it's just don't worry about it. What?
said we can go water for like an hour this video. Oh. We did a lot. And good stuff. This facility will produce multiple products. To divide them, you need to set a filter on the sorter. You can use tab or the okay. arrow keys so on I the right side of the filter. keyboard to quickly set the filter when building the sorter. Right there. Have another one front. And you are the only thing I can make so far, so let's thank you. And I know there's two things that can do. So we're gonna have to do a little bit of a gap. Or a few barrels there. There we go. We don't have power. You know, I kind of forgot about power. And stuff. Iron, please. Iron. 
they can't get any better. I don't want power through.
Ah, uh, Danny needs to think like. I know what I'm doing, even though I don't know what I'm doing. I need to act like I know what I'm doing. Oh god. I'm about to go for 20 minutes of my time right there. Just trying to get that deal with. Thermal power station. Such power facilities need to consume chemical energy fuels. If you want it to generate continuous and stable power, feel, you need feel. to ensure a sufficient fuel supply at all times. Insufficient required items. You can click the replicator button at the bottom right of the screen to open the panel and manually replicate these items. Like always, I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys enjoyed, make sure to hit that subscribe and like button. Stay frozen. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.